Hello, good morning and good evening. My name is David. I am originally from Germany, but I do live here together with my wife and our little son in the Czech capital in Prague, as you can see here on the background, in a virtual background. And it's a pleasure for me to host you to our Airbnb online experience with the Plague Doctor of Prague. We will go back to the 18th century. We are now walking just in the beginning over the Charles Bridge. So that's the famous bridge from the 14th century with all those statues on it. And we, as you can see, we walk towards the one of the defense towers of the 13th century. And we will slowly go to our starting point, where we deep dive into the times of the plague of the 18th century. There's an interesting dress I do have here. Of course, I have a lantern. I have my doctor's bag, by the way, 95 years old. And the dress is according to Dr. Schnabel of Rome. Let me introduce him to you. 1656, he did this kind of invention, how to protect yourself wearing such clothes as a plague doctor. So you can see the gloves, the stick, but also the uh, famous hat you will see. And of course, the beak. We did not use the hat. We didn't use gloves. We have assistants taking care of buboes in the past year. We talk about our famous hero. For us, he's famous, but he's quite forgotten nowadays. Alexander Shamsky, one of the young heroes, because he was one of the doctors who remained and tried to help for two long years during the plague times here. He also got the disease at the end, and then he died when he was 27 years old. So we will remember him always, and that inspired us to write this tour. We talk also about his book and also about his healing methods during our tour, because he talks about interesting prevention. For example, beer. But not any beer, it's the garlic beer. Three liters per day, per day of uh, garlic beer. This is what you have to drink. Also, children one liter with the garlic. And that's an equal amount. You take the same amount of garlic and beer, you put it into your pot, and then you cook that for two or three hours, and then you drink that warm, warm and thick, the garlic beer. Good luck with that, by the way. And the Czech people already said in the past, if you survive that, you also survive the plague. We are slowly heading towards the old famous hospital of St. Francis. That's still an active hospital nowadays. So we will try to explore what happens during the times of the plague with a quarantine, of course, the quarantine that was also here. And of course, we want to know what doctors used to do in the past. So we go a little bit more into a medical excursion here. So just follow me close by. And watch the witchcraft, it's full of metal horses here. We are now slowly heading towards the end of the tour. You can see we are here at the Monastery of St. Agnes and we are heading towards the old church over there that was the very first hospital in Prague in the 13th century and then became in the 14th century the first quarantine. We talk a little bit about here what quack doctors used to do. And that's our competition in the past. They sold their rubbish services in this very same hospital. Only doctors were active. So it was kind of a competition, but not really. So when you want to know more, you have to follow us. Follow Alexander Shamsky and this famous doctor. And we welcome you to Prague.